What's up guys, it's Matt Collins Jones here, also known as the D365 Geek, and today we are talking about Microsoft Flow and controls, specifically the apply to each control. So this is a control available in Microsoft Flow that allows you to do an apply to each over an action. So let's take a look at it. I'm in a Microsoft Flow at the moment, and my trigger is a uh, when a new form, when a new response is submitted to a Microsoft form. So what we're going to do is we're going to click Add New Step, and we can click Control in here, or we can just type in, and we can select Apply to Each. Clicking that, it asks us for an output and we can specify the output as being a list of response notifications. After that, we can then do something else. So we could um, send a mobile notification, for instance. Now, um, what this will actually do is this will go through each one of the survey responses that we get back. So why is that important? Well, it will allow automation over a number of events. So if you, um, if we're polling and we get um, 10 responses, uh, instead of this flow running 10 times, it will get all the responses. And then in this apply to each step, it will run through each one of the responses in order and then do that, uh, do those actions based on those responses in there. Uh, meaning that the flow will run once instead of running 10 times. So this allows us to do actions based on number of records or number of inputs that we get. So it's a pretty powerful tool. One thing I want to show you is I'm actually going to remove this step for a second. So I click delete. And I'm going to add a new step and I'm going to look at the Microsoft Forms uh, actions. And we're going to go we're going to get response details. So I'm not adding a, uh, anything else. I'm just going to click get response details. And if I add in the details from the previous one, so the form ID is this forms pro uh, test survey, which is that's the one I've got in my trigger. The response ID, when we click into the field, we get a list of response notifications response ID, which is taken from this trigger. And once I add this in, we'll notice that the apply to each automatically gets put around this get response details. So what that means is we are, we are wanting to get the responses that have been submitted. And as soon as we do that, Microsoft Flow detects, do you know what? That needs an apply to each around it. So we're going to add it. Otherwise, you'll be missing responses. So that's what this does automatically. So Microsoft Flow is trying to help you understand the type of logic that you need. Um, so yeah, this is a great feature of Microsoft Flow. I use it all the time, especially for my Forms Pro survey responses. Uh, do you guys use this? Do you guys use this uh, control? Uh, let me know in the comments down below. Please like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Ciao for now.